welcome to a new video about Visual Basic for Applications. In this video I will cover the option explicit and the reason why an option gets mandatory. Let us start with a very basic example. In the first step the user enters a number and in the second step this number is shown in a dialog box. So we choose developer and Visual Basic to open the Visual Basic Editor. Then in our workbook we select Insert Module for a new module. And now let's type a very simple macro sub option explicit test Ends up. You see the camel case in option explicit test indentation and yes we use a variable named dim number as integer. Then number equals input box. Ah, this time we need parenthesis prompt please enter a number comma title just say number in put so whoops closing bracket so we create the input box the user enters a number and this number is stored in this variable. Then the message box, whoops, the number is and number and we use VBOK only and you see VBOK only is the default so we can leave it out and title is output something simple so delete that we now have declaring a variable named number number equals the number we, the user enters and this number is presented in a dialog box to the user. In the first step, option explicit is not declared. I run this macro with this button and ah, please enter a number, say 33 and OK. The number is 33, as expected. But Think about a little typo. Instead of number, we type number. A P instead of a B. And we run that marker again. Please enter a number uh, 34 this time. OK. Uh, the number is and nothing. No zero, no value, nothing. What happened? We declared number with a B and we used numpair with a P. So without option explicit, every typo gets a new variable. So let's use option explicit. And now we run that marker again. And you see a not declared variable raises a compile error. Variable not defined. With option explicit, we have to declare every variable we use. And that's the reason why option explicit should always be used. The typos don't get new variables. 
so we can stop the macro change our typo and run it again please enter a number and you see everything is all right so option explicit is an option but it's mandatory for good programming thanks for viewing this video see you next time bye